What's up guys, Zack Scott here playing Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu for the Nintendo Switch. I'm excited to be playing a Pokemon game on a much bigger screen than usual with stunning graphics. We are going to have fun. Thanks to you guys, my channel has exploded in popularity lately. The first Pokemon game I ever played on my channel was Pokemon X, and its first episode has over 4 million views, and that's all thanks to you leaving over 35,000 likes. I would be thrilled if this video got anywhere close, so thanks in advance for any likes and comments you can give me on this video series. Also, thank you for subscribing. We just hit 3.3 million subscribers. That's incredible, and I cannot thank you guys enough. I'll do my best to bring you even more awesome videos. Just leave a comment letting me know which games made you subscribe and which games you'd like to see me play in the future. Now, without further ado, let's play Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. So, let's go! <laughs> he came out of the TV. <laughs> oh, I guess we're going into the TV with him. Okay. Well, I better wake up. How are you? Hello there. Glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People affectionately refer to me as the Pokemon Professor. Nice. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. And if you want to know how people tend to interact with these Pokemon, well, some people keep them as companions, others have them do battle. As for myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. It's his job. Now, why don't you tell me about yourself? Okay, well, I, my, hey, my name's, oh, this, what do I look like, okay. Uh, these are just the options that we have. Uh, you can be male or female. And I'm just gonna go with the default, the one it selected first. That's me, I'm Zach. Uh, how about a name, Zach, of course. My name is Zach. Oh, my name, <laughs> my name <laughs> is Z-Dog. Of course, my name is Z-Dog. <laughs> right, so your name is Z-Dog, yes. <laughs> That's me, Z-Dog in the house. All right. <laughs> All right. This boy here is your friend and rival who has grown up right next door to you. I don't know. I think I would remember that. What was his name now? I don't know. <laughs> this is a false memory. This was implanted in my head. Uh, I have to name this guy? Come on. Don't make me name him. Looks like a Kevin to me. This guy's name is Kevin. Here we go. Kevin. It was Kevin, was it? Yes. <laughs> I'm Z-Dog, and my rival's name is Kevin. Mm-hmm, I see. His name is Kevin. All right. Good for him. Z-Dog, my boy. Your very own Pokemon tale is about to unfold. Yes, a world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. That's right. Pokemon, let's go. It's so bright. Close your eyes, everybody. All right. Oh, it's blurry. That was a crazy dream I had. Whoa, I'm real. All right. What are we going to do? We're going to move around. Okay. Anything to search here? Any, anything to do? Can I get on my computer, surf the web for a little bit? There's an email from Kevin. Oh, great. Hey Z-Dog, so here's what you need to know as a trainer. Press the A button and you can talk to all kinds of people. And if you tilt the control stick uh, more, you can run. Plus, if you open up the main menu by pressing the X button, you can save your progress too. Boy, I can't wait to get started. Can you? Kevin. Can I have this? It's a fluffy Pikachu plush. All right. So by the way, the, I wasn't able to use my pro controller unless I overlook something. I'm coming up. Who is? Do I have to name you too? Up and at him. Oh, it's Kevin, okay. <laughs> Morning, Z-Dog. <laughs> What's going on? You've got one weird look on your face. <laughs> no, you too, Kevin. Oh, never mind that. I couldn't wait any longer, so I came to get you. Today's finally the big day. 
We're finally going to get our first Pokemon from Professor Oak and become real trainers. Oh, but before we do, you read the email I sent you yesterday, right? You better have. Check your computer if you didn't. I did. And if I hadn't, I, I would just say I did. I'm going to book it to Professor Oak's lab, so see you there. All right, I guess I, too, will book it, as they say. <laughs> as Kevin says. All right, this TV, can I read the TV? They are showing a movie on TV. The scene is showing four boys walking down a set of railroad tracks. It's Stand By Me. They're watching Stand By Me. But it's time you got going. Okay. Watch out for the ghost train. Uh, dishes and plates are neatly lined up. Hey, Mom. I think that's my mom. Yes, it's Mom, M-O-M. Off you go to Professor Oak's lab. Kevin asked the professor to give the two of you Pokemon of your own, didn't he? Yeah, I guess so. I wasn't ready for one. Inside this, there's nothing inside. All right, I, I don't have to check everything, do I? Beautiful updated graphics. It's Pokemon, but for the Switch. We are already in a big, big town. Okay, here we go. It may not be that big. Uh, can I check the mail? Z-Dog's house, oh yeah, oh yeah. Name it after me, not my mom or my parents. Pallet Town, shades of your journey await. Sup, girl? I'm raising Pokemon too. When they get strong, they'll be able to protect me. Good for you. Where is Professor Oaks? <laughs> is he like right next door or something? What's up with you, dude? Technology is incredible. Now you can connect your smartphone to your game console and send data between them. Yeah, that is actually really true, and I think that's uh, one reason this game was designed. <laughs> Uh, Oak P Pokemon Research Lab. He lives, like, right next door to me, dude. Alright. Here we are. This place is... Looks... <laughs> looks small on the outside, but it's huge on the inside. I also study Pokemon as Professor Oak's assistant. Good for you. Professor Oak may not look like much, but he's the authority on Pokemon. Many Pokemon trainers think highly of him. I do too, by the way. I also study Pokemon as Professor Oak's assistant. Okay. Kevin, what are you doing over here, dude? I can't, I, I, I'm using like just the red side, like one of the individual controllers here. I wish it would let me use a pro controller, but no. Oh, Z-Dog, Professor Oak isn't here. Do you think those Pokeballs hold the Pokemon you and I are supposed to get? I have no idea. I can't wait to get mine. I don't know, I don't think we should mess with them. Let's, there's like six over here, let's grab these instead. There are Pokeballs in a mysterious machine. Ooh, spooky. Can I read Professor Oak's email? There's an email for Professor Oak. <laughs> the Pokemon League at the Indigo Plateau is full of Pokemon trainers who have raised strong Pokemon to challenge and battle the Elite Four, the ultimate trainers. Professor Oak, please visit, visit us again. Pokemon League HQ. What do these signs say? Just scribbles. Press the X button, it opens the main menu. Got it. To record your adventure, select save. Be sure to save often. All right. It's a Pokeball. It contains a Pokemon. Yeah, it does. Okay, well, great. Should I leave? I'm gonna leave. Maybe Professor Oak will show up. If I if I start bailing, this one will show up. He'll be like, ah, sorry, I'm late. Probably, I don't know. Well, maybe not. We're okay. Well, what the heck? Uh, okay, hold on. I don't know where P P Professor Oak is. Hey, what's up? Oh, hi, Z-Dog. Looking for Kevin? He went to pick you up. Did you miss each other? He said that he was going to go to Professor Oak's lab with you. No, I got him. Can I read Kevin's email? Whoa, is this a picture of little Kev, Kev? It's a picture of Kevin. All right. You only got one story to your house. We got a two-story house. We're rich. All right, where are we going? <laughs> it looks like you have a two-story house. How do you get up there? Okay, oh, there's Professor Oak. He's talking to the birds. I don't know if I want to mess with them. Well, my good Pidgey, thanks for the help. All right, thank you, Pidgey. I think I understand you all a bit better now, thanks to this. Ah, if it isn't Z-Dog. Hi, Professor. Oh, of course, I promised to give you and Kevin your Pokemon today, didn't I? Well, in that case, why don't we head over to... Hmm? <laughs> well, what's this? It's a Pikachu. It's a Pikachu. Indeed. Don't look at me. He looked at me. What do I do? Oh, you encountered a wild Pikachu. 
My, my, I surely wouldn't have expected a Pikachu to appear around here. But since the opportunity has presented itself, why don't we practice some Pokemon catching? You just have to throw out your Pokeball and try to land it on a wild Pokemon for the chance to catch it. <laughs> Hold your, okay, Joy-Con horizontally point it straight to the screen. Okay, press A to pick up the Pokeball, get ready. You can throw the Pokeball by waving your Joy-Con. Don't forget your surroundings, okay, yeah. Ah, uh, what? I missed. Keep an eye on the rings as you throw your Pokeball and watch out. Some Pokemon move. What do I do? Got him. Nice. I think I did it right. Is he in there? Oh, he's in there. He's locked in. All right. You caught a Pikachu. Good for me, right? Absolutely. Okay. I'm happy. So, uh, <laughs> that was a pretty fine performance for a first timer, my boy. Why don't you pick up that Pokeball and give the Pikachu you caught a name? Okay. Yeah, I got it. Whoa. What in the? Now that's a lively Pokemon if I've ever seen one. Whoa. Hey, wait. Come back. Where, uh, where did he go? I've not had this happen before. Wait, there are three there now. What happened? Did it arrive here? Professor Oak. Those Pokeballs there. I swear there were only two a second ago, but now there are three. A perfectly reasonable reaction, my boy. You see, one of them is a Pikachu that Z-Dog caught just now. So wait, Z-Dog, you caught it yourself? <laughs> well, I I've never seen that happen before. Ho, 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 how interesting. He's Santa now. Well, my boy, this is it. Take that Pokeball and keep good hold of it this time. All right, I'll do my best. It was the middle one, right? <laughs> it's a shell game. I, yeah, I got it right. Oh, wow, okay. I'm petting him. He broke out of his, uh, I'm shocked. Kevin shocked. Oak is shocked. Did I forget to wash my hands? All right. Pika Pika. Pikachu became your Pokemon. Great. <laughs> hmm, what a strange Pokemon indeed. It sure doesn't seem to like staying in one place, but it looks as though it's taken a shine to you, Z Dog. Why not give it a name? Yeah, why not? Uh, yes. Yes, indeed. This is clearly... P-Dog. <laughs> All right. P-Dog. He's been added to my party? Excellent. All right. Professor, I choose this one. Kevin got an Eevee from Professor Oak. All right. See you guys. <laughs> I'm, I'm all, and I'll take this third one. <laughs> no, I won't. Okay, fine. It's really cute. Eevee is just what I wanted. For a new trainer to catch their first Pokemon themselves. Even I've never seen such a thing. Yeah, Kevin. Take that, Kevin. All right. Peace. I'm out. <laughs> oh, uh, just one more thing. Now that you two are setting out as trainers, I'd like to ask your help with something. Take this with you on your journeys. Okay. What are you what are you getting? What are you doing? What is that thing, Professor? This is the Pokédex that I've designed. It automatically records data on Pokémon you've seen or caught, and it makes an entry for each. It's an extremely high-tech tool. Z-Dog and Kevin, I want you each to take one with you. All right. You got a Pokedex from Professor Oak. Thank you. You'll find you can't get very detailed data on Pokemon just by uh, seeing them. You must catch a Pokemon to gather the most complete data. To make a complete guide to all the Pokemon in the world, which, by the way, I won't do. <laughs> that was my dream. But I'm an old man now. See, he, uh, he hasn't even done it, so you can't expect me to do it. Too old to get the job done myself. That's why I want you uh, young trainers to fulfill my dream for me. Nope. 
Kevin's gonna have to do the heavy lifting there. Get moving, you two. <laughs> this is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. A Pokedex, huh? We're gonna meet so many Pokemon. This keeps getting better and better. I'm setting out right now. Z-Dog, you should do the same. If you think you're ready, that is. Don't taunt me, Kevin. All right, we are... <laughs> Here we go. I wonder if... Uh... Oh, hey. Hey, ma'am. Oh, it's mom. <laughs> oh, how cute. This is the one you got from the professor? What? You caught it yourself? That's amazing. Yeah, you should have seen it. Kevin couldn't even do it. Uh, what should I call your new friend? P-Dog. It's a lovely Pokemon. Pikachu. Pikachu! My, how energetic. I suppose that means you two will be setting off on an adventure today, right? I thought this day might come soon, so I planned ahead and got this for you. You got a town map from mom. You put the town map in your bag. By using that town map in your bag, you'll always know exactly where you are. Safe travels, dear. You and P-Dog be good to each other. All right. I can attempt to be good to P-Dog. So long that P-Dog is good to me. There he is right there. Uh, so now we're to, um, how do I chop down the bush? No. <laughs> hey, guess what? I got a poke. I got a Pokemon. Technology is incredible. Yeah, I know. I know. But I don't do that. I'm raising, yeah, guess what? I have my own Pokemon now as well. So do we go up here? I think so. Oh, jeez. What the heck? Here we go. Oh, no. Oh, no. You encountered a wild Ratata. Get ready. Uh, what do you want me to do? Get ready. Got him. Now, don't run away from me. Locked and loaded, please. All right. Caught another one. All right. Great. I'll add that to my party. I got on my first throw. I like I like how that's pixelated still. Rotata's data will be added to the Pokédex. All right, great. Check motion. What does that mean? What? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, now is this is this one that I want in my party? I don't know. I don't think so. Next. All right, great. All right, cool. Route one. Heck yes, it's route one. Whoa, 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 whoa. Holy cow. Let's go up here. What's up, my dude? See those ledges along the road? It's a bit scary, but you can hop down from then. You'll get back to Pallet Town quicker that way. Yeah, super scary, dude. Now, do I actually want to capture anything else? I don't know. Maybe. But also, maybe I kind of want to just go forth. I don't know what I want. That's the thing. Let's go. Maybe I'll go capture this dude. Hey. Hey, come here. <laughs> do I ever? Okay, a wild Oddish. Uh, did he just attack me? What the heck? Nice. All right. I don't know. I mean, like, I'm used to kind of assembling my party, you know. But, I mean, like, I don't know... I don't know if this is the... I mean, I don't know. Here we go. Leveled up P-Dog. That's nice. Level 6. All right. P-Dog grew to level 6 and learned Quick Attack. That's great. Good job. And sure, here's a uh, Oddish. Sure. It may be mistaken for a clump of weeds. If you try to yank it out of the ground, it shrieks horribly. It's a grass and poison type. Okay. Excellent. Well, uh, let's uh, let's just keep going then. I don't know. It, it might want me to actually capture a whole group of Pokemon, which is why it's presented me here with all of these. Let's go get a bird. <laughs> a bird. A flying type. All right. Hello. A wild Pidgey. I'm ready. What? Oh, I got him. Oh, I thought he dodged. <laughs> I can't believe I got him. You can't fly away from me, Pidgey. All right, Pidgey has been caught. Oh wow, and, and Ratata leveled up as well. All right. 
It's a flying and what? I missed it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I skipped. I skipped too fast. All right. It's okay. It's okay. So you know, I don't. I don't want another one. Let me just try to get through. No, no, no! Don't touch me! Don't touch me! No! Help! Help! Okay, there's a Rattata. Let me see. Can I skip them all? Skip them all. Yes. Sup? You've got a pretty sweet Pokemon with you. I'll bring along my favorite Pokemon later, so you'd better battle with me when I do. All right. Maybe. Well, uh, no. Ah, oh, I didn't mean to jump there. All right. That's okay. Now we gotta get through a horde of birds and a rat. No, 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 no! Now, so what, okay, can I just faint these guys? Like it's all just catching. Run away. Yeah, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. I got away safely, good. <laughs> all right. Don't touch me. <laughs> oh, Viridian City. Excellent. Trainer tips. If you run out of Pokeballs, you can buy more at a Pokemart. Great. Hey. I go shopping in Pewter City occasionally. I have to take the winding trail in Viridian Forest when I go. Okay, well that's what I would do too if I had to go there because it might be one of the only ways. She looks like she's catching insects or something up there. Okay, a dead end. Hey. It's an old northern lion. Oh, so you're working on a Pokédex. <laughs> then I'll give you a piece of advice. You'll do well to stock up on Pokéballs at a Pokémart before you continue your adventure. Would I? Now, do I? am I really trying to get them all? Oh, look up there. Look up there. Exciting, right? Those Pokéballs you've got. You have Pokémon, don't you? It's great that you can carry and use your Pokémon anytime, anywhere. Yeah. Technology, man. It looks like this tree can, okay, can be shot, chopped down. We'll chop it down. We'll chop it down then. How do I chop it down? Pokédex. Hey, let's save. They wanted us to save, right? All right, this is good. Save your progress. Easy. All right. So, uh, Pokédex. Do I have any? Like, can I choose some abilities here? What do I? Not, not the Pokédex. I probably look at my party. That's right. Sorry. Uh, party. Do you, does anyone have a chop ability? You don't, do you? How do you do this? Uh, I, I like how I can change the name. I only elevate. Oh, here we go. Very finicky. All right. Well, we're good. I, you know, I don't expect. Anyway, we'll figure it out soon. Later. Sometime. I don't know when, but we'll get it. Don't worry. Let's go uh, in here. Oh, no, let's talk to the people first. What's up? Did you know there are actually two kinds of caterpillar Pokemon? No. Caterpie has no poison, but Weedle does. Watch that your Pokemon aren't hit with Weedle's poison sting. Okay, thanks for the advice. And then what's up here, huh? Oh, wow. Hello, ma'am. The machine is undergoing maintenance. Please come back later. Can I talk to this guy? Whoa, Chansey. There's a Pokemon Center in every town ahead. They charge no money, so don't be shy about healing your Pokemon. Oh no, socialism has taken over. No, <laughs> just kidding. Okay, have you battled a trainer? If your Pokemon's speed stat is higher than the opposing Pokemon's speed stat, you'll attack first. Okay, cool. If you catch a lot of Pokemon, they will be tucked away in a Pokemon box. You have a Pokemon box in your bag too, don't you? Please feel free to read any of the books on the magazine rack in the corner. The receptionist told me so. It's so kind of her. Okay, well then let's, uh, let me, I'm just gonna read them all right now. There's a magazine called Pokemon Journal. There's a flashy advertisement on the back cover. Will you read it? Oh, they just want me to read the ads. If you use what are called secret techniques, you can chop trees, open paths, light up dark places, and so on. They are sure to be very useful. Do you want to learn secret techniques? Yeah, don't you want to learn secret techniques now too? Yes, the Kanto Secret Technique Association. Yes, I do. Let's read, let's learn them. Let's read, uh, I wanna know. But who knows if I will know? I may never know, I'll know. What's up here? Whoa, what's, dude, what? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, I 
Yeah, I really don't know. What is the two-player thing in the corner? The lower right or whatever? I have no idea. Hey, you came up from Pallet Town? You must know Professor Oak, right? I've got a delivery for him, but I really can't leave the Pokemon unattended right now. Can I get you to take this to Professor Oak for me? I got the parcel from the Pokemon clerk. Okay, great. You put the parcel in your bag. Thanks, kid. Say hi to Professor Oak for me, too. All right. Do you want to head straight back to the lab? No. I'll be there soon. What's in here? I've got to buy some potions. You never know when your Pokemon will need quick healing. Uh, welcome, may I help you? I'm here to say no thanks. <laughs> I don't want to buy anything right now. What are you buying? You want to help me shoplift something? This shop does good business in paralyzed heals, I've heard. All right, great. I'll keep that in mind. Next time one of my Pokemon is paralyzed, I'll come exactly to this shop right here. What's up? Yo there, kid from Pallet Town. Man, word gets around here, huh? <laughs> he knew. All right, what's this? Oh, it's at school. Finally, I can learn something. Oh, I didn't mean to leave. <laughs> but what does the school say? Let's read the sign out front. Trainer school. Get schooled in school. All right, time to get schooled, Zach. Z Dog. I'm going directly to the teacher. I'm going to be the teacher's pet. Okay, everyone. Where can you find information that is useful for trainers? That's right, in this classroom. You can find it on the backboard or in books. Please read bulletin boards for trainer tips in towns and cities too. The blackboard lists status conditions that can happen to Pokemon during battles. Which topic do you want to read? Uh, no. <laughs> None of them. What about here? In addition to HP, Pokemon have PP, <laughs> which they use to perform moves. Recover PP <laughs> by resting your tired Pokemon at a Pokemon Center. Okay, got it. <laughs> All right, PP. If you walk around with your Pokemon or let them battle, they'll grow to love you even more. Great. Whew. I'm trying to memorize all my notes. And what about you? What say you? We're studying about the Pokemon types. Let's see, Pikachu is electric type. That means it has an advantage against water and flying type Pokemon. Gotta remember that. All right, now these two clowns up here, they're, I see them waiting, I see them waiting. They're blocking me, but let's see what happens when I, uh, oh, they're not blocking, uh, yeah, they are blocking. Meow, says Meowth. What do you want? You can't pass through here right now. We're in the middle of guard duty and it's very important. Uh, I guess I gotta go to Professor Oak then. <laughs> what are you doing here, twerp? Shoo, go pass through someone else. Uh, I guess Team Team Rocket doesn't want anyone. All right, fine. Let's just head back then, shall we? Got a package for uh, for uh, Professor Oak. Uh, okay, I, I've talked to you already. So, where do we go? Because I don't want to really encounter any more Pokemon <laughs> right now. Did I capture all of them on this on this route? How can I find that out? There's an Oddish, there's the Rotata, there's the birds. Help, 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 what was that? Oh, okay, that's Pikachu. Okay. All right, great. Professor Oak, I, I hope that he's in his laboratory. Let's go see. We got a parcel for you, buddy. What is up? Why Z Dog back so soon? How is little Pikachu doing? Hmm? Hmm? <laughs> all right. He's climbing all over me. Please don't shock me. He might shock me. I hope not, though. Oh, goodness me. Pikachu here seems like it's really come to be a true partner to you, Z-Dog. I think you've got what it takes to become a great Pokemon trainer. What's that? You have something for me? You handed the professor his parcel. Oh, so my order arrived. Thank you for bringing it to me. Kevin's here. Oh, great. Hey, Professor Oak. It's about my Eevee. Its moves are... Whoa, Z-Dog. That's so cool. Pikachu just rides on you like that? Ah, and now we have Kevin as well. What fine timing. I've just been de de I've just been delivered some very handy items which I think I'll share with the two of you. I got some raspberries. <laughs> you put the raspberries in your catching pocket. Great, I've been starving. I'll stop you right there, son. Those berries are for Pokemon to eat, not you. 
<laughs> They're deadly to humans. No. <laughs> when you want to catch a Pokemon, try throwing one of those at your target before you take a Pokeball in hand. You'll find that wild Pokemon will be so happy to have a berry to nibble on that they'll become much easier for you to catch. <laughs> that was close. I nearly swallowed one of them right up myself. Now then, you two. It's up to you to decide if you want to catch lots of different Pokemon or simply focus on training up your favorites. My only request is that you have fun either way. Well, I'm having fun making videos, so I'm having fun that you guys are here. Again, as a reminder, if you want to keep watching this series, please subscribe. I think you're going to I think you're going to love it and also be sure to like this video, help this channel grow. As for me, I want to catch tons of different Pokemon. Okay, that that is your job then, Kevin. I'm going to focus on an elite squad, but I want to train them up to be strong too. <laughs> All right, well, you just focus on catching them all, and uh, I'll focus on uh, just being me. Kevin says, wait up. Come on, Z-Dog. You do know you can do more with Pokemon than just catch them, right? You're, if, if you're a trainer, you can have Pokemon battles with other, other trainers, too. I'll show you exactly what I mean. It's battle time. Oh, great, Kevin. Here to mess everything up. It's battle time, he says. You are challenged by Pokemon trainer Kevin. All right, come on, Kevin. He sent out Eevee. Wow. Go p Dog. All right, here we go. Fight. Let's just fight. Eevee's level six. Uh, let's just go with Thundershock. Here we go. p Dog used Thundershock. Wabam. Oh yeah. The opposing Eevee used Tackle. Ouch. All right. Well, I got some other tricks up my sleeve. I can use a... Uh, well, you can actually click these for info. Growl. The user growls in an endearing way, making opposing Pokemon less wa wary. This lowers their attack stat. Tail Whip. The user wags his tail cutely, making uh, opposing Pokemon less wary and lowers their defense. And then this, Quick Attack. The user lunges at the target at a speed that makes it almost invisible. This move always goes first. It's a power of 40. Compared to Thundershock, also 40, but, you know, I don't know. What do you think? Let's do the uh, Quick Attack. Here we go. I go first. But I was already going first, I believe. Nice. She's using Growl. Oh, great. Okay, okay, it's okay. My attack fell. Well, let's just go for it. Quick attack again. Boom. Growl again, man. Stop growling at me. I'm going to keep attacking you. Okay, my attack fell again. Let's try a uh, a uh, thunder shock again. How, how about that? Done. The opposing Eevee fainted. Okay, perfect. Well, well, well. I got 32 experience points. Your party Pokemon also got experience points. You beat Pokemon trainer Kevin. What? Did I lose? And I got 120 for winning. Nice. You did lose, Kevin. Aw, oh, jeez. There I went mouthing off like I knew everything. And then I lost. How embarrassing. I probably should have trained my Pokemon up a bit before trying to a battle like that, huh? Let's battle again sometime. Did you enjoy your first taste of battle, young Z-Dog? Your partner Pikachu seemed to like it. All right. Peace. Or do you want to say anything? Battle against many trainers and help your Pokemon grow strong. And keep catching more and more new Pokemon while you're at it, too. Okay. I can, I can definitely do that. There is no reason why I can't. All right, now where to, huh? Well, I guess, do I just go north? What's up with you? Hey, Z-Dog. Oh, hi. Oh, just look at Pikachu. You two are already looking like great partners. And I've got the perfect little gift for such a great team. Here, take this. You got sportswear from your friend's big sister. You put the sportswear in your clothing trunk. Try putting that on Pikachu. You can go on an adventure in matching clothes. Oh, it seems like that. Oh? What's going on? What's going on? You want me to do it now? All right. Let's 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 dress you up. P-Dog looks very happy. All right. Uh, partner? What? Play with P-Dog. Okay, yep. Yeah. There you go. So weird they call them partners. <laughs> okay, play with P-Dog, Joy-Con, uh, ZR, and uh, Pet. Got it. Y button sent to your hand. Okay, let's... Let's give this a go. All right, pet. Am I petting him? <laughs> there you go. He's happy. All right, there you go. Oh yeah, 
Get those nips too. All right, how about a, uh, can you have one of these? Give your Pokemon a berry, okay. Take a berry with ZR or the A button and bring it over to P-Dog's mouth. Okay, if you drop, okay, great. There you go, buddy. Eat this. There you go. That's a big berry, right, boy? And then punch him, no, slap him. Okay, that's good, you've, you've had enough berries. There you go. There you go. You're happy. Come on. Now what? Don't don't you hit me. Okay. Do you want another berry? Is that the deal? All right. I'm done. <laughs> it seems like Pikachu wants to play. Don't forget to show it some love from time to time. Play with P-Dog has been added to the main menu. Press the X button to go see. I Okay. Select this option to play whenever I want, which is never. Let's go. <laughs> Route was, where am I going now? I mean, maybe that route's open up again. Do you want to talk to me? Do you have anything new to say? Okay, no, you don't. Okay, well, let's uh, let's go. Oh, jeez. I don't really need any more Pokemon. Were you here before? Thanks for helping me out with the parcel. The Pokemart is a convenient chain selling all sorts of items, so please come visit us. Oh, I know. I'll give you a sample. Here you go. All right, I got a potion. Thank you. And the potion is in my medicine pocket. Your Pokemon may take damage when you battle other trainers, so be sure to use a potion on them if that happens. He's barely hurt. He's fine. Tough love, right? Uh, okay. Yeah, he's there. Squeeze me. Oh. Trainer's eyes have met. I'll battle you with my favorite Pokemon. Okay, I'll use P-Dog, which I guess is my favorite right now, until I get a better one. Now he's my partner. The youngster Ronnie. All right, Ronnie. What you got, buddy? Ratata. P dog. All right, rat. Get ready. Thunder shock. Got him. Whoa. Oh, nice. Is he paralyzed? Haha. <laughs> it may be unable to move, but you're using a tail whip, so don't show me your butt. He showed me his butt. How rude. My defense fell because I was so insulted. Here we go again. Let's do a quick attack. He's not paralyzed if he's doing that kind of stuff. Got him. Excellent. Fainted. Goodbye to you. Nice. Level seven. All right. Everything's great. Auto screw to level five. That's cool. And I beat Youngster Ronnie. You're really strong. And I got 60 for winning. Where did I get those? Are they from him? Are we betting on this? And three Pokeballs. I mean, he wagered a lot. <laughs> oh, get that bird away from me. And who are you? Is this Kevin? Huh? You look pretty pleased about something, z Dog. Oh, you beat another trainer? Good job. Well, since we're on the topic, the Pokemon you sent into battle might have lost some HP or PP. You, you should take him to a Pokemon Center and get them healed up. It doesn't cost any money and doesn't take long at all either. Just remember, heal up after battles. Uh, I'm okay. <laughs> I think I'm okay. All right. Uh, no, we know your story. All right, let's go up here. I, I was just thinking if there's anyone new. Well, I could go in here. I, I I think mine are healed, but I mean, I guess I, they probably want me to check this out. That's why they mentioned it. You guys open yet? Welcome to the Pokemon Center. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? Yes, why not? It's free, right? I'll take your Pokemon for a few seconds then. I don't think they need to rest, but I'm just saying maybe I should. I like how the, the, the eight bit, that's so cool. Thanks for waiting. Your Pokemon should be all better now. We hope to see you again. The pixelated sprites look super cool in this game. And it's a decent throwback, too. All right, well, uh, where to, where to? Oh, they, they stopped blocking the path so I can actually continue exploring this town. Good for me. Uh, there's an Oddish over there. I would just look, what, was there something here? No, okay. All right, nothing over here. Well then, we're gonna go up here. Sup. Wow, your Pokemon is riding on you. That's super cute. But I think my Pokemon would be a bit too heavy for me. That's why I have it walk with me instead. 
Oddly, <laughs> check your party in the main menu and choose a Pokemon and take it to take out of its Pokeball, and it will walk around with you. It's just so adorable to see them. Here, let me do it for you. Okay, thanks. <laughs> I don't want this filthy rat <laughs> walking next to me. I'm going to your house. All right. What's in your trash? I'm just going through your family's trash. It's okay. All right, coming up with nicknames is fun, but it's not so easy to do. Clever names are nice, but simple names are easier to remember. You can change your Pokemon's nickname from the main menu. Just view your party and choose the Pokemon with the name you want to change. Understood. Uh, question. So what were they saying with the with the with the party and bringing it out and what? Return to Pokeball. Take out a Pokeball. So I can. Okay, so he's gonna travel alongside me. It's only one. So Pikachu's gonna be riding with me, and then Oddish. You know, I don't really need these guys uh, to be traveling alongside me, so I'm just going to put them all away. There we go. It's distracting, man. <laughs> all right. Thankfully, Pikachu is resting on top of me. Hey, there's a bird. My daddy loves Pokemon, too. Well, good for you and your daddy. Let's see. I don't even know if my character has a daddy. I've seen his mom. What this? Viridian City Pokemon Gym. Excellent. Sup, dude? This Pokemon Gym is always closed. I wonder who the gym leader is. All right. You're, you're right. Viridian City's Pokemon Center is closed. I don't know how to do this yet. I don't have the ability. I don't believe. And this says what? Trainer tips. Okay. <laughs> what is this? Route 2. All the way to Pewter City. So, I mean, how do I know if I've caught every... I don't have anything to do this. Oh, here's a guy. Let's catch him. Where are you going? Oh, you encountered a wild caterpie. All right. Get ready. Got him. Stay in there. You gotta stay in there. Nice. All right, you caught a Caterpie. Good for me, right? And 11 experience points. I'm glad we get experience points for this. All right, Caterpie's data will be added to the Pokédex. If you touch the feeler on top of its head, it will release a horrible stink to protect itself. Gross. <laughs> get out of my party. <laughs> All right, uh, no, he's fine, he's fine. Uh, okay, so here's a shed up here. What is this? Oh, hi. If your Pokemon uses a move that's the same type as itself, the move's power will get a boost. All right, that's good to know. This is a tunnel, right? Are you going to Viridian Forest? There's a natural maze in there. Be careful you don't get lost. Okay, I'll, I'll try to not get lost. Ooh, the Viridian Forest, okay. I came here with some friends to catch us some bug-type Pokemon. My pals are all itching to get into some Pokemon battles. All right, I'll let you know what I find. Uh, that's... Oh, there's a new one right there. Hold on. Oh, what, what's up with you? Hey, do you have a big Pikachu? What does that mean? Is that a euphemism? Of course I do. You're challenged by Last Joanna. All right. Ratata. I don't know how to say that. <laughs> I think that's how you say it. I know how to say P Dog though. P Dog's coming out. Get ready to fight. You're level four. I'm level seven. Thunder Shock. And you may not be able to move afterwards. We'll see. Almost fainted. Attack. He's gonna tackle me. Ow. And I'm gonna do a quick attack just to make sure this goes first. Boom. Don't you just love it? I do too. <laughs> 16 experience points. All right, Pidgey grew to level five. Pidgey learned Gust. And I beat last Joanna. Oh no, really? Yeah, what do you think about that Pikachu? Pretty big, right? All right, well, we're gonna continue onwards. Don't talk, to, uh, so many things. Did you know, get away from me, bird. I don't wanna talk to a bird. 
But there's a thing over here. Here we go. What are you? That's a new one, right? I like how you can see them instead of a random encounter. But it kind of makes them scary to try to dodge. This is the wild weedle. All right, choose a berry from your bag to use it. If I have to, I will. Bag. You like berries? How about a raspberry? All right, use this item. Do I got to throw it or is it going to... There you go. You're going to love this. Excellent. That was a good one. Caught him, especially with that berry. I mean, he's going to love that berry. All right, you caught a Weedle. Awesome. And people are ex are leveling up like crazy. 47 experience points. Wow, look at all this. And like everyone leveled up. Awesome. Great. Was that because they did so well on that capture? Weedle's data will be added to the Pokédex. Beware of the sharp stinger on its head. It hides in grass and bushes where it eats leaves. All right. So I got a full party. I don't know. Let me get off this trail here. What the heck? What's going on up here? Oh. Oh, you have a partner Pokemon. <laughs> Let me get a better look. You just want to fight me and, and the Pokemon that's with me. All right. Bug catcher Brian is here. Sending out Weedle. All right. Well, my attack strategy is going to be about the same. I'm going to fight with Thundershock. He's level three Weedle. <laughs> oh, wipe out. Got him. Excellent. All right. I only got nine experience points because I'm so good. <laughs> Before I knew it, I lost. You did. You did, but I got three Pokeballs. Well, that was pretty cool. Whoa, what's, why is that like that? What, what, what are you doing like that? What is that? It's tiny. You encountered a wild, why is it so tiny? I don't understand. All right, bag. Uh, let's give you a raspberry. There you go. Why was it so, sh it's not as shiny, is it? Or was it? What? Okay. Got it. Now, it's not as shiny, is it? Why was it? Oh, it's out. Great. So close. You almost got it. Well, what about another berry? You want another berry? How many berries is it going to take? Do you want one more? Why is it yellow? Okay, let's use another berry. It's still yellow. Okay, well, get ready. I'm ready. What? This is so hard to do. I don't understand. All right. I'm wasting a lot of balls on this. Got it. Please, please stay in there. I gave you like three berries. Come on. Yes. All right. So it said it's tiny, and it confused me because it... All right, everyone leveled up. So what's the deal with this? Yeah, keep leveling up. That's good. But why was that... Electric, what's this deal? It's it's just small? Is that all it was? Okay, next. All right, cool. I got a tiny one. Okay. Ugh. What was over, excuse me, what was over here? Is this a dead end or, or what? I don't know about these tiny ones. There's a red thing over there, right? Oh, it's just a Pokeball. Five Pokeballs, nice. I don't know why I you, people would, what is it? Well, there's a red one. What does the red one mean? What does the red one mean? It's huge, okay. Get ready, I'm ready. It's green, so. Wow, what? That was perfect. Got it. Excellent again. So the so the blue swirls are tiny. The red swirls are huge. That's good to know, of course. 
Well, there we go. I mean, everyone's leveling up like crazy. P Dog is level nine. And wants to learn the move Double Kick. Uh, let's see. Forget an old move. Double Kick is a fighting style. Let's get rid of. Uh, Let's get rid of Tail Whip, maybe? Or should I get rid of Quick Attack? Let's get rid of Tail Whip. Sure, forget that move. There you go, one, two, and ta-da! P-Dog. Tail Whip, and uh, he, I mean, Double Kick. He learned Double Kick, he forgot Tail Whip. All right, excellent. And, okay, Quick Attack. Man, everyone's growing here. It's, I can't control them. They're all growing too much. All right, so this was just a big one, an XL, as you can see. He looks about the same. <laughs> okay, well, that's cool. Please let me out of here. Do, no, come on. How do I... Yeah, I'm going to run. Run away. I want to give up catching that Pokemon. What the heck is that? What is this? Oh, I don't have this one. I might as well catch it, right? A wild metapod. All right, get ready. Got it. Stay in there. Nope. Gosh, man, he hates this. All right, here we go. That probably wasn't very good. Are you going to stay in? All right, got him. That's fine. All right. Another tiny one, right? I mean, everyone's leveling up like crazy. Okay. He learned acid. Nice. Pidgey learned what? Okay, he didn't learn anything. Okay. And then this is... What? Weedle is evolving. Awesome. Good job, Weedle. Here we go. Oh, creepy looking. Looks like an alien now. All right, he evolved into Kakuna. All right, nice. Kakuna's uh, data will be added to the Pokedex. Able to move only slightly when endangered, it may stick out its stinger and poison its enemy. Okay. Maybe it'll turn into a beautiful butterfly. I learned Harden. Good for you. All right, and then this is uh, Metapod. Hardens its shell to protect itself. However, a large impact may cause it to pop out of its shell. Yuck. <laughs> that, that would be gross. Uh, get away from me, guys. Come on. I think I got... I mean, I don't know. I don't have a huge desire to catch all Pokemon. Another, another small, big, big... I don't know. What's this way? What's this way? Excuse me. That's a big, big version of what I just have. Uh, what I just what it just evolved. I got a tiny mushroom. Okay. Gosh, guys, no. <laughs> All right. I'm just gonna go ahead and run away. All right. I hope I'm doing the right thing by running away. I mean, I don't really, I don't really. Gosh, back to back. All right. Get out of here. Run away. Okay. I think I'm okay. I don't want to get too OP, you know, and everything I find. Gosh, there's like a, just a wall of Pokemon. How do I get to the other side? I don't even, I'm going to try. I'm going to weave. Oh, I, I, I did it. I, <laughs> and another, another set. Whoa, no, no, no. Bird, bird. Nah. He got me. Pidgey. I'm running away. I'm running away from you. Okay. Here's a ball right there. Antidote. All right, awesome. What was that? Oh, it's one of those, okay, Metapod. Does that sound scared me? Hey, what's up? I came here with some friends to catch some bug type Pokemon. My pals are itching. Wait, did I just go in a full circle? Oh, good, okay. <laughs> I wonder if I can get by, oh, nope. You saw me. All right, hey, you have Pokemon, right? Come on, let's battle him. 
All right, but mine's, I mean, mine's pretty powerful. I've been leveling mine up. I went in like a full circle and just like leveled mine up a bunch. Uh, bug Catcher Rick from The Walking Dead. No. <laughs> All right, Caterpie. What level is that? P-Dog is like super powerful. What level are you? Three. Okay, got it. Let's do my new move. Double kick. And then here we go. Uh, one. Oh, that's not very, very powerful against him. Not very effective. Okay, I guess the fighting type doesn't go against, what was it, Bug? I don't know. I have a chart that I like to use when I play Pokemon games, so I will uh, take a look at that. Quick attack, so we can faint him, though. There you go. I don't quite remember all of the, uh, you know, the synergies and, and whatnot between all the, the types. All right. Caterpie can't hack it, if you say so. I went in like a full circle, not meaning to. Uh, sure. Oh, hold on, raspberries, hold on. Can I get this? Hey, no, no, I want this butterfly. Hey, where is this butterfly? Hey, come here. Ha ha, what's his name? A wild butter free. All right, here we go. Uh, I'm gonna have to give it some berries or something. I don't think he's uh, appreciative. Is it gonna make it slightly easier to capture him? Oh, great, now he's moving. That, that makes it so much easier. How, another one, maybe? Uh, what do you think? How is that easier to catch him? I don't know if giving him multiple, I haven't seen any proof that giving him multiple fixes this. Uh, let's give him one more. If this doesn't work, then I'm just gonna try to throw the ball at him. Yeah, I don't know about this. Here, get ready. Ha! <laughs> stay in there. Please. Pretty please stay in there. No! All right, so close, you almost got it. Here we go, well, I, I'm just gonna do it again. Don't worry about it. That was good, right? I was hoping you get tired from fluttering back and forth. Come on, stay in there. All right, get ready. I'm gonna do it again. What are you doing? Stop it. What, why are you doing that? That was like perfect, come on. Stay in there, please. No! Okay, I don't get it. I'm gonna do it again. What? He moved. Not my fault. Come on, that's good, right? These things are actually hard to capture. What? What a shame. How, how am I? Okay. Raspberry. Come on. Use this item. Come on. There's a berry for you. I really don't understand. Raspberry, come on. I give him like five berries now. I don't even think this, I don't even think it matters how many berries, it's so weird. I think it's just one, just one will do good, maybe. That probably, that probably doesn't keep him, right? That could have been better. Okay, gosh, this is so crazy. That, I mean, that's a good one, right? How long do I gotta like, come on, what? Okay, hold on, bag. No. Oh, I, I did help. So give him the raspberry, use this item. I don't think that, I think it's one at a time. Okay, so yeah, now we get ready. Well, he ran away. <laughs> he took all my berries. Okay, well, you know, I, man, I don't know. I don't really need him, but still, I felt that that should have been a little easier. What the heck? So I think I think what I figured out is that you give him one. Hey, what's up, dude? I was throwing Pokeballs to catch Pokemon and I ran out of them. That's why you can never have too many Pokeballs. So true. Uh, let's go over here. Like I said, my goal is not to catch them all. I wish I would have caught him, though. Hey, do you know if Bulbazar appear in this forest? I don't. 
I have no clue. <laughs> How would I know? Last Brittany. It's Brittany, guys. Whoa, who is this? Yikes. P Dog. Let's do it. Fight with Thundershock. Get ready. Whoa, bam! Almost fainted. Oh, he's paralyzed. Maybe. She. All right. Now I get to just kind of uh, do a quick attack and all will be good. Gotcha. Goodbye. All right. Well, that's pretty awesome. Could you listen to what I have to say, please? Well, what do you have to say? What, what's wrong? What's up? I heard from a friend that they saw Bulbazar around here. It wasn't registered in their Pokedex, though. I wonder if it was true. I don't know. How would I know? Oh, there's the butterfly again. I'm coming for you. Oh, there is a Bulbazar right there. All right. Hey, Wild Butterfree. All right, so I think you could just use one. Use this item. And then use it. And then look, now, it, right below the CP24, there is a, uh, a berry, so. Oh, uh, what was that? All right, get ready. That was right on the money, come on. What the heck was that? What? I don't really understand how some of these work. That was good, right? Come on. Tell me that was good. Tell me you're gonna stay in, no! I don't understand how come I'm not capturing these. Bag, raspberry, use the item, use it. All right, get ready. All right, I'm ready. That was so close. I don't understand. Come on, dude. Excellent, stay in there, please. I did it perfect, just stay in there, please. Just lock it in, yes. Yes. Butterfree has been captured. All right, man. Man, and everyone got a ton of XP for that. P Dog is 10 now. Oh my goodness. Excellent. Wonderful, man. Look at all this. Look at all this. I know, it's crazy. All right. And then what's going to happen with uh... oh, cat the other cater Caterpies evolving as well? Is there any way? I guess you can maybe cancel and evolve. Maybe? I, don't, I think you couldn't create in different versions for like the 3DS, but... All right, Metapod. Harden. So I already caught a Metapod. Okay. All right, Butterfree's data will be added to the Pokédex. Its wings, covered with poisonous powder, repel water. This allows it to fly in the rain. It's a bug flying type. Awesome. Well, there's a Bulbasaur right next to him, so hello. The rumor was true. Hey, buddy. All right, a wild Bulbasaur. Uh, let's just, I'll, I'll use a, a raspberry, why not? There you go, use it. And now he has a, uh, you know, that below his name. Excellent, come on, Bulbasaur. Stay in there, lock it in. What? It was excellent. Come on, how come? All right, I'm not wasting any more berries on you. All right, stop it. What? All right. Another excellent, just stay in there, Bulbasaur. Yes, <laughs> locked and loaded. I wonder if the Pokédex would tell me like all the like who all is on a route. 
All right, let's let's move on. We got Bulbazar. It can go for days without eating a single morsel. In the bulb on its back, it stores energy. All right, tucked him away. Excellent. I'll probably include him in my main party eventually. Let's get out of here. What's up? You want to fight me too? This is a big forest, isn't it? Yo, you can't punk out on a battle if you're a real Pokemon trainer. I'm a real trainer. I just don't like poning the kids. All right, bug catcher Doug. All right, Kakuna's out. Looks like an alien for real. All right, well, get ready. Uh, I don't remember what's going to be good. Is, is lightning going to be good against this? Electricity good? I don't remember. It's, oh, really good, actually, but using Harden, that's fine. It's uh, Defense Rose, it's fine. We're probably going to cut right through the defense with a quick attack. Awesome, gotcha. Super cool. I am happy with that. All right, huh? I've got no other Pokemon to battle with. Well, there's plenty here to capture, so just <laughs> just capture them. That's what I did, right? Uh, I, I am curious if there's anything over here, but I also don't want to run into anything that I don't want to do. Am I going in another... This, this place is so... Hey, what's up? Do you do you want to fight? Do you want to know the trick for throwing a Pokeball? Well, y yes, <laughs> yes, I do. I feel like sometimes I, I don't do it right, and I don't know why. But Jocelyn is here to challenge me with a Pidgey. Here we go. Let's do this. Fight. Uh, double kick. Does flying work? I don't know. Let's let's try it. Boom! Oh yeah, nice. A critical hit. So, so what's your advice? All right. Your battle was right on target. All right. So, do you have advice for me for throwing these these things? Because I I could use it. Throw a pokeball to hit the center. You know, the center of those two rings, right? All right. That doesn't teach me anything new. Uh. I don't want anything to do with these guys. Where the heck am I? This is like a maze. Okay. Hey, wait up, what's the hurry? Why the rush? I'm not in that much of a hurry, I guess. I'm just having fun making videos. Bug catcher Sammy. All right, send out Metapod. All right, P-Dog is coming out right now. Fight him, right? Double kick. Boom. Oh no, it's weak against bugs, isn't it? Okay, well, sorry. He's using tackle. Ouch. Barely hit me. Let's go ahead. I, I, uh, let's just quick attack. Got him. All right. All right. I give, you're good at this. I am pretty good at this. All right, well, we, uh, I'm going up here, what's this? Finally, what is this? Uh, Pewter City ahead. Okay, what's gonna be in Pewter City? Hello? You remind me of Kevin. The higher a Pokemon CP is, the higher its combat power is. I hear CP is a value made up of various stats and things combined. Have you noticed the skinny trees on the roadside? They can be chopped down with a secret technique called chop down, I hear. Yeah, well, <laughs> that makes sense. It's all in the name. All right, well, we are now, uh, we're still not quite there, but <laughs> we're almost there, hopefully. How do I get over there? It's Pewter City, guys. Kevin's here. Hey, nice, I was hoping we'd run into each other. All right. You know, there's a Pokemon gym up this way, right, Z-Dog? You can battle against the gym leader there, and he's seriously strong. If you want to get stronger, you've definitely got to try to take him on. Ha, <laughs> jeez, P-Dog, you're ready for a good battle too, huh? Who would it be? All right, then, you're making me want to cheer you guys on too, so take these. 
Five potions from Kevin. All right, thanks, Kevin. I bought some for you with the prize money I've been earning in all my battles. Beat that gym leader, Z Dog, and you can really call yourself a true trainer. Give it your best. All right. That sounds fun. What is this? Hey, lady. You should be careful with your money. Don't go blowing it all in one place. But it's also fun sometimes to buy a whole bunch of Pokeballs at once. Haha. <laughs> What's in here? Is this your house? Nidoran, sit. And what's up with you? We got our Pokemon in a trade, so it's finicky and hard to handle. Pokemon that you get from trades grow faster, but they won't listen to a weak trainer in battle. If only we had some gym badges. Well, I might be able to pick one up a gym badge today. Maybe, right? Well, uh, what's over here? Hey, dude. There aren't many serious Pokemon trainers here in Pewter City. They're all bug catchers and the like. You know, just hobbyists. But Brock at the Pewter City Gym isn't like that, not one bit. What is he like? What is Brock like? And hello, I'm gonna rest my Pokemon probably. Uh, would you like to rest them? Yes. I'll take your Pokemon for a few seconds then. Put them all in, they are exhausted. Well, maybe, <laughs> maybe, maybe Pikachu P-Dog is a little, maybe, I don't know. Thanks for waiting. All right, thank you so much. All right, well, uh, what's going on? I'm trading Pokemon with the girl next to me. I had two Pikachu, so I figured I might as well trade one. What's up with you? The Pewter City Specialty Pewter Crunchies. They're 500, no. Limited one package per day, though. Oh, sure, I'll take, sure, why not? What does it do? <laughs> Thanks, they're very hard, so be careful. I got a bag of Pewter Crunchies, what do they do? Other oh, medicine, okay. Whatever. I really want a Pikachu, so I'm trading my, 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 your what? Your Clefairy for one. And then over here. Sup. The Pewter City Gym Leader Brock is a rock type Pokemon user. Rock type Pokemon are weak to grass and water type moves. If you don't pay attention to the type matchups, you can't defeat the Gym Leader. All right, so rock and grass type moves. What Team Rocket is at Mountain Moon? Huh? I'm on the phone, scram. So how do I rearrange my roster here? Party, uh, let's see, move Pokemon. I don't really want Pidgey, or I don't want anyone here really. Uh, but I need someone, hold on, let's let's open up the uh, Pokemon box. Uh, let's see. So rock and water, let's see. Um, hold on, check summary. Bug, grass. Did he say grass and water? What did he say? Uh, I'll, I'll listen to him again. Hold on. I don't have any water types. All right, let's go back. What did you, what did you say to me? Let's go back again. Back again. Just get out of here. <laughs> Rock type. We do, oh, grass and water. Okay, great. Easy. So all I do now is I go in. I look at my bag. And then, uh, Pokemon box. And then, so, anyone who is a, uh, let's see, how do I, how do I view these? Check summary. So we're talking about bringing in, uh, sure, Oddish. Um, and, Oddish and Bulbasaur. So we basically just wanna move Bulbasaur in here, right? And to get rid of uh, maybe this dude, Kakuna. I don't know. So go ahead and uh, move him. Remove from party. Excellent. And Bulbasaur is coming into the party. There we go. Nice. Awesome. Okay. And we have Oddish and Bulbasaur who can do some attacks. Well, there we go. Um, so what's going to happen here? Let's go down. Excellent. Should I try to just do the gym today? Like, just all in one? I don't know. What's up? Psst, do you know what I'm doing? Uh, no. <laughs> I'm spraying Lura around to get wild Pokemon to come visit my flower beds. Psst, 
Do you know what I'm doing? No, no, no. I uh, repel to keep wild Pokemon out of my flower beds. <laughs> All right, that's pretty funny. And then, uh, what say you? Oh, uh, you're a trainer, right? Brock's looking for new challengers. Follow me. Okay. Well, I can definitely do that. I'm here. If you think you've got the right stuff, you should take on Brock. I got the right stuff. I'm going in. <laughs> All right, here we go. Everyone's ready for this, right? Hiya, you're here to challenge the gym, aren't you? I'm not a trainer, but I can tell if you're worthy of challenging the gym leader. Now, let's get started. The Pewter <coughs> excuse me. The Pewter City Gym only allows trainers who know type matchups to enter. There are a few types that have an advantage against the gym leader's rock type Pokemon. But for trainers who have never challenged a gym before, we have uh, them use either grass or water type Pokemon. You have to show me a grass or water type Pokemon if you want to face the gym leader. Got it. Uh, Oddish is good. He's jumping high. Great. That Pokemon is exactly what I wanted to see. Head on in and aim to become a Pokemon champion. All right. I will. Do these statues say anything? Pewter City Pokemon Gym. Gym leader Brock. Certified trainers Kevin. Ugh, Kevin's. Uh, so now here's a question. Party, uh, can I move him to my number one? Let's see, move, and then move Pokemon, and we're gonna swap him out for Oddish. That makes sense to me. All right, and now Oddish is gonna be in the lead. This is the Pewter City Gym. Trainers here are a bit different from those you faced so far. I don't know about that. I don't know anything about that. You're challenged by Picnicker Amara. All right, Geo dude's coming out. Oh, he looks mean. Come on, Oddish, you got this. Here we go, Oddish. What you gonna do? Uh, you are going to fight, and you are going to use. Uh, oh wait, absorb. Is that is that a, a, an attack? It is good. Excellent. That's actually really good because it actually makes me absorb. Okay, great. Take this. Take this. Oh gosh. <laughs> Super effective. You're gone, dude. All right. Excellent. Oddish. Oh, you're quite different from the challengers I faced. Yeah, because Kevin's been here, right? I'm way better than him. <laughs> All right. And then you, coming up behind you. Boo. Stop right there, kid. You're 10,000 light years from facing Brock. I don't know about that. I have... I don't think I, don't think I am. But if you say so... Camper Liam. All right, Geo dudes coming out. Look at him flex. Go Oddish, go. All right, here we go. Fight. I'm gonna do the same exact thing. Absorb. Come on now. I might hit level 10 before. Nice. Geo dude is just gone. Super effective. Sorry, buddy. All right, 35 experience points. That's awesome. And he's now level 10. Excellent. Speed went up a little bit. And uh, there you go. Oops. Light years isn't time. It measures distance. <laughs> True. <laughs> well, Brocko buddy. What's up? I'm here. I'm here to face you. So, you're here. I'm Brock, Pewter City's gym leader. You can see just by looking at my Pokemon how rock hard... <laughs> my willpower is my Pokemon are all hard as rock and have true grit determination that's right my Pokemon are all rock types <laughs> you're going to challenge me even knowing that you'll lose <laughs> that's what a trainer's honor demands so be it show me your best that's my best Brock voice <laughs> all right gym leader Brock you can't be he has two Pokemon I got several <laughs> I'm gonna be fine you got a Geo dude right now. Looks like a meatball with hands. A very, very old meatball. He's level 11. I'm still going to try to absorb. I'm level 10. Let's see if it hits him in one hit still. Oh, Geo dude is gone. Take that, Brock. Brock likes rock. That's why his name is Brock. B Rock is what I would name him. B dash rock. <laughs> All right, P Dog grew. That's good. Bulbazar, who might be B Dog, grew. Onyx. I'm not. I'm gonna keep battling. 
Onyx is coming out. Whoa! Uh, that, that's big. Absorb. Absorb. A rock throw. Don't kill me. I'm fine. Absorb. I'm going to heal, though. That's great. Oh, one hit. Super effective. Man, that is a big Pokemon. Goodbye. Nice. Oddish is growing. Level 11. Wonderful. Special defense is up. All right. Pidgey's level 10. Metapod's level 8. Bulbasaur's level 5. Bulbasaur learned Vine Whip. Bulbasaur grew to level 6. <laughs> All right, Gym Leader Brock. It seems I underestimated you. All right, I got a ton of money for winning, almost 2,000. All right, as proof of your victory, take an official Pokemon League badge, a Boulder badge. All right, thanks, Brock. High five, Pikachu. Boulder badge. With a Boulder badge, Pokemon up to level 20 from other trainers will listen to you. Without question. Oh, and wait, take this with you, too. I got a TMO1 headbutt from Brock. And that's in my TM case. If you use a TM or technical machine, you can teach your Pokemon the move within it. A TM can be used as many times as you like, so use it on any Pokemon you want. TM01 contains Headbutt. It deals damage to your opponent's Pokemon by ramming them with a head as hard as rock. All right. Well, that was great. There are all kinds of people in this huge world of ours. Some have their Pokemon battle, some just like to raise them. I'm hard at work here to learn how to become a Pokemon breeder who helps raise Pokemon. You're aiming to become a strong trainer, right? Then you should challenge all the other gyms. All right, that's my plan. I am now out here, a champion. Do you think Kevin's waiting for me outside? Hey, you there, newbie. Don't tell me, you gotta be Z-Dog, right? Uh, I am, that's amazing. Ha, I knew it, I'm always right. I'm blue. I heard from my gramps that that two new kids set out from Pallet Town to become trainers, just like I did once. So I came to check you out. I was thinking you might want some advice on how to beat the gym from an expert trainer like me, but it looks like I showed up too late, huh? Seems you're not too shabby yourself, so I guess you've earned a reward, newbie. Five great balls from Blue. You can put the great balls in your catching pocket. Those will be even better for catching Pokemon than plain old Pokeballs, and hey, that thing you've got there, that's a Pokedex, right? So Gramps finally went and made one. He used to make me just scribble on a map with a pencil about where I encountered Pokemon. You better do a good job helping him out. He may be Professor Oak to you, and sure, he's an old coot, but he's still my Gramps. Smell you later, newbie. Okay, see ya. <laughs> Smell you later, newbie. Well, we've had an exciting adventure today. Come back next episode. We'll continue exploring uh, this town. And furthermore, uh, we are going to probably explore outside of the town now that I beat one gym. I don't know if we're going to get to another gym next episode or what, but I had a great time. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. See you next time for more. Goodbye. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. Check out these other awesome videos. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Join my Discord. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. <laughs>